I'm staying with my friends Sergio and Lisa in Chizon di Valmarina, a small town with an important past. Chizon di Valmarino is indeed a very old town. With its castle Castelbrando, it became a defensive position against the barbarian invasions. The castle today houses a four-star hotel and spa, a museum and a theater. Café Roma, a beautiful café that seems taken out of a movie set from the 60s. In 1977, Chison di Valmarino was used as a set for a movie with Marcello Mastroianni and Laura Antonelli called Molly Amanti. It is said that in the afternoons, they would sit out here and have a drink or a coffee. The Prosecco Road, located between Conegliano and Valdobbiadene, is a remarkable land in northern Italy that stretches for 34 kilometers where a renowned bubbly white wine is produced, the Prosecco. Prosecco DOC or DOCG is produced only in this area and is produced from a grape called Glera. This is an area of incredible beauty, covered with vineyards on steep slopes. On July 2019, the area received the title from UNESCO of World Heritage Site.
about 30 minute drive from Chizon de Valmarino, at 3,000 feet on the pre-Dolomite mountains, we arrive at the Antica Osteria La Muda. This is the oldest licensed restaurant in Veneto. It's been open since 1470. Here you will find local cuisine and local wines for about 25 euros per person. I highly recommend you book a table before showing up. We are now heading towards Valdobbiadere, to the heart of the Prosecco Hills, to the area where the best Prosecco in Italy is made, Cartizze. Cartizze Prosecco comes only from this hill, Cartizze Hill, and is produced in a very small amount of bottles every year. Here you can grab a glass of Prosecco, grab a bite, or just sit down, relax, and watch the sunset. This is my favorite area of the whole Prosecco road. No matter what you came looking for in Veneto, you will bring back home a lot more you thought you would. Unfortunately, I didn't get to visit any of the vineyards now because this is the slowest time of the year for them. But I'll be back this summer to taste a fresh Prosecco from this beautiful region. Until then, follow me, like my videos and subscribe to my channel because it's all about Italy. This is Mark from Food Travel Planet signing off. Ciao, alla prossima!